Hello, how are you? Today I want to talk to you about favourite colours. I like red. Red is my favourite colour. There are lots of different kinds of red. Dark red, light red, bright red, dull red, purpley red, orangey red, brownie red and so on. I like red that's bright but not too bright. I like the colour of London buses, for example. I like the colour of UK post boxes. Generally, I like strong colours. I also quite like strong purple and strong orange. When I was younger, I once said during a maths lesson that my favourite colour was gold. Everybody went, ooh, but it was a lie. Red is my favourite colour. I think red has always been my favourite colour. I think red is my favourite colour because it's so dramatic. Red is the colour of wine. Red is the colour of blood. I also love how vivid red is. Red looks so bright to me. It always catches my eye. My optician says it's because I can't see things that are far away. Apparently, if you're short-sighted, red looks brighter. But as I said, I think red has always been my favourite colour, even before I needed glasses. When people get angry, they sometimes say they saw red. I'm not quite sure if people actually see red when they get angry, but red is often considered to be an angry colour. While I don't support anger or violence, I think I like red because I like its energy. I like the colour red, but I don't want everything to be red. I like blue skies. I like green grass. I like clothes in different colours. I don't look good in red. I think I look good in purple or brown. I think these colours suit me best. I do have red clothes though and I like the colour of them. I like looking at my friend's red makeup even though I will never ever wear it. What other things are red? Tomato sauce is red. Stop signs are red. Lipstick can be red. Clothes can be red. Cars can be red. Roses can be red. Some people hate red. Some people prefer weaker colours, like light grey. My work colleague's favourite colour is beige. When I was younger, I couldn't quite believe that some people hated red. I thought, what if what I call red is what someone else calls blue? What if we're seeing things completely differently? A tomato looks red to me, but maybe it looks blue to someone else, and we'll never know. But now it's not so difficult for me to accept that we're all seeing the same things, but feeling differently. We're all the same, but we're all so different. Do you have a favourite colour? Has it always been your favourite colour? Why 
Is it your favourite colour? Do our favourite colours reveal something important about who we are? That is the end of today's podcast. Thank you so much for listening. Until next time.